Hey guys, Joshua Baintech. Today the iOS 7 Evaders Jailbreak has been released. So I'm going to put together a video how to guide and some tips and tricks of what to expect and what to do. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. First of all, you're going to want to check and make sure that you are on iOS 7.0.4. And the way that you're going to check that is go to your general tab. I am using my iPad mini, by the way. And make sure you're up at the top. Software update. And then you'll see iOS 7.0.4. And if you're not on it, you can always update it. And I recommend updating through iTunes and not uh, over the air. So the next part that you're going to see is um, I'll have download links in the description of where you can find the evasion um, tool. And you can actually use a Mac or Windows PC. So when you open this up, it's going to verify just you know follow along with me if you want i recommend you know looking at these kind of videos and then doing it yourself and then follow along with the videos and stuff like that it just kind of helps out but this is what it's going to look like from start to finish it's actually pretty easy i'm glad to see this kind of progress going on for jailbreaks for ios 7. it's been a while Okay, now you're going to see over on the right hand side, you got the app there that's installed, or you can select from the folder that opened up. Alright, so welcome iOS 7 jailbreak and basically Evasion 7 is untethered, which is awesome. And it's going to show you what device you have connected, so make sure that you are connected and it's as simple as uh, looking here. Once you connect it, you'll see if it's supported or not, so really cool. And so once you're ready to go, just hit jailbreak. And you just let it do its thing. I remember last year when I got my iPhone 5, it was it felt like years uh, to get the jailbroken uh, iPhone again because before that I had a, my iPad and um, I w yeah my iPhone 4s was jailbroken, but when I got the iPhone 5, obviously it came with um, a version of iOS 6 that could not be jailbroken, and so I had to patiently wait. And I was actually had just pretty much joined up with iPhone developers dot com as a writer. So it was an exciting time for the iOS community and the jailbreak community. I remember writing about it, remember um the countdown, all that kind of stuff for the jailbreak for iOS six. So now we're at seven. It kind of felt like it got dumped on us uh, out of nowhere. So a lot of people were surprised about it. Um, some people were waiting for iOS 7.1 uh, version, but hey, here it is. So let's go. Let's do this. I'm not complaining too much at all. I appreciate all the work that developers do. Um, they spend countless hours on working on this stuff. And with that said, you can actually go to the support page in PayPal or go to the Evasion uh, website and you can donate to them, which I highly encourage you to do. And I'm not going to pause this or anything like that. I kind of want to let you see from start to finish and see how long it takes and things like that. 
And what I also recommend doing is before you jailbreak anything or mod anything, hack anything, always make a backup first. I made a backup before I did this and I did it through iTunes, put the backup on the computer. That way I'm just, you know, for the chance if anything were to happen, I'd have my butt covered. All right, so something's going on with the device now. It's rebooting the device. So I got some dual action going on. Steaming the reflection, hey guys. Uh, but <laughs> anyways, um, watch. I got my iPad being recorded here and also got a screen capture going on my MacBook just to kind of see what looks what's going on on the computer side and also on the iPad side. Looks like it's about halfway there, according to the status bar. To continue, please unlock your device and tap the Evasion 7 icon. So obviously you got to wait for it to reboot. Slide to unlock. There's the Evasion icon. Tap on that. It's going to reboot again. So if, in case you're wondering, this device here is a Note 3. It takes some pretty spectacular video and pictures, so it's very nice to use for any occasion that, you know, something like this where I can record a screen, record something else going on. Um, just very impressed with the quality that comes out of this phone is just phenomenal. So, so far we're, looks like we're on the home stretch and it's taken at this point seven and a half minutes. Continue, please unlock your device. Still got evasion sitting there. All right, so now it says it's done. So let's see how it reboots. That should be it. This is one of the things I love about jailbreaking a phone or iPad or whatever, an iOS device, is that most of the time it's just a one-click deal. So stinking easy, it's ridiculous. A monkey can do it. Um, like some of the Android stuff I've had to go through, which, you know, I don't mind going through the manual way of rooting something. It uh, increases your learning curve. You're able to do stuff that you're not or haven't been able to do in the past. But sometimes it's a headache and it takes a lot of time. And as you can see, this is taking about under 10 minutes to do. So let's see what the iPad's doing. All right, reading kernel. I really like the Evasion um, logos and stuff that they do, so I think they're pretty sweet.
I normally don't like to touch anything, like even though it says to you, it says done and you can hit exit. I just don't like to really touch anything until the process is done and it tells me that everything is okay. So it looks like we're going through another boot. And this should be it. There we go, there's the city of store. Awesome, so it looks like we're all jailbroken and as you can see, it's just as easy as that as the one click method. Just download the file, open it up, connect your device, make sure it's compatible and you're good to go. So, and then you can open up your city of store and go from there. So yeah guys, this has been a video of how to jailbreak iOS 7. And if you have any questions, uh, let me know. Let me know in the comments of what you've been looking forward to using a jailbroken device. And until then, uh, be sure to subscribe to this channel for more content and videos like this. Obviously, we'll see some more jailbreak videos and some jailbreak apps for iPad and hopefully the iPhone 5 I have laying around as well. So, all right, guys, if you like this video, if, if you thought it was helpful to you, definitely leave a comment and subscribe and like it. All right guys, peace out.